assalamu alaikum dear parents as you are aware that we are shifting from whatsapp to google drive to reduce number of daily messages via whatsapp and to create a repository for future reference google drive is a storage and synchronization tool developed by google let's see how google drive works for every email gmail we can have a google drive for example if i go to this particular email id we have a google drive similarly this particular email id we have a google drive and here if i go for example islamic books then we have books related to english books related to english similarly we have books related to uh, bengali now in from our school you have you have received one messages from our school you have received one messages that is let's open the messages so this is the message from school you have received in this message it says that click this particular link so if you click this particular link and you if you have a gmail account set up already in your phone whether it's the iphone or android phone you can choose for example i am choosing this particular email id and i am clicking ok now it will show me the list of folders available right now you can see only four folders inside this this is a syllabus folder where we have all the syllabus of all classes for example if i want to see the syllabus of class 5 i just need to click it and it will show me all the details of class 5 syllabus class 5 syllabus similarly month wise what should be the uh, what is defined for every month for example social studies science and all these things it is available in the syllabus folder similarly if i want to see the routine routines are available here i don't need to call a school i lost my routine i lost track of routine send me again you just check the google drive and you will find it Similarly, daily messages. This particular folder is very important. Inside daily messages, for example, this month is May. So you open the May month and go to, for example, eight is the eight is the Monday. And go to eight. All the classes related all classes folder are there. For example, if it is class five, I will just open class five and I will see a document now if there is more information for example there is more information in the sense there is an unfinished board work that particular screenshot or picture will be uploaded here if there is any particular audio shared by curry sir that is will, that will be also available here similarly if there is any video link that will be mentioned in the document so let's open the document this is the class 5 document looks like but if uh, here we can go and we can see math and we can then go to right, do it right right drag in the right direction we will see the details this is one of the way to see, see it or we can click the three button right most three button and we can choose print layout like that is print format so when i choose the print layout then it will show me print related format so all the details are here then measure my progress if there is any unit test any project any group discussion those activities it will be mentioned here if you want to register any issues you should go to this particular link and you should register your issues all other details related to this particular class 5 on that particular Day, that is 8th may will be available here similarly for example if you are from nursery you just open nursery one you will see all the nursery related information here nursery related information similarly to know to see it in a print layout format go here and change it to print layout format this way you can see all the details phonics and its activity or, or whatever youtube link related to that all will be shared here if there is any test or any uh, measuring the progress or tracking the progress of nursery student that details will be provided here measure my progress if there is any issue you want to log just follow the issue registration Similarly here, these are the books because nursery parents or LKG parents, they always 
complain or they have concern that why books are submitted to school because sometimes for checking purpose and, and many other purpose we submit the books so if the books for example blooming birds english a or fun with arabic alphabet or all english topics are submitted then here yes will be written for example blooming birds english a submitted means then submitted should be yes so every day what you need to so what you need to do as a parent you need to come to this particular folder daily message and may folder for particular month may month and a particular day you need to open and related to the any class you can see what about the what about details are provided here this is one and there is one more folder that is called archive folder in this archive folder whatever month is gone that is past month for example may we will put it here and then we will bring june in the main folder so that if you want to see any past related past month related info you have to go to the archive folder and you will see and slowly slowly here we will add some islamic books you know some very few islamic books and also we will add Uh, result related to students and other information uh, attendance related to the students those things also we will add so in sh in short google drive is a very powerful tool and we can we don't have to storage all the details in our um, mobile or in our pc it will be in the cloud itself and sometime we have a issue that is we don't see the reflected document that is we don't see updated document in the google drive to resolve that particular issue you have to update your google drive from your app store or play store if it is if it doesn't solve your issue then you can change your email id hopefully it will resolve your issue thank you very much